Sanders has designed the jar opener and turning aid, which has won the NetWest Lenta Award this year, and also the folding bicycle. Mark, could you tell me something about your design of the folding bicycle? Right. Um, I uh, thought bicycles were far too complex for what they actually do, um, and in particular folding bikes. Uh, and so the concept of this bicycle originated after seeing how successful the McLaren and similar baby buggies are. Um, the concept is that when it's folded, um, the wheels are together like a, a walking stick with wheels. So it's much easier to actually transport when you're a pedestrian or on a train or on a car or such. That's right. You don't actually have to carry the whole weight. You uh, wheel it along on its wheels. Mm. Uh, and also the, the structure is much more simplified than a, a standard bicycle, having um, three tubes instead of about eight or nine tubes, which uh, most bicycles yeah. have. I notice um, that we don't have a conventional chain mark. Tell me about that belt drive you've got there. That's right. Well, the main reason for that is uh, our, our prime market would be um, businessmen, people like this, who uh, would lift it in and out of car boots, on and off trains, and the last thing they want is oil on the trousers. Mm. Very good. I notice also you've got a front brake and one brake lever, right. but uh, yep. no back brake. In fact, the back brakes, um, the American and Continental system of coaster brake, pedal backwards and it locks the back wheel up. Oh, yes. Very much like a sort of fixed wheel and you just sort of stand up and everything stops. That's right. right. Yes, yes. Um, I'd like to now for you to put you on the spot and watch you sort of fold the bike up, please. Right, right. OK. I must explain that um, the folding sequence is actually slightly longer now than it will be in production. Um, I've, I've got... Um, further ideas on that, but basically this joint here is disconnected, that's in fact part of a child's seatbelt clasp, um, and the, this part drops down, the wheels come together to form effectively one wheel at the end of the stick, the, there's a hub and a recess which interlock the wheels together, and this clip just holds the whole thing together. And as you can see, it's rapidly turning into a, a walking stick with wheels, very much like the uh, baby buggy. Mm. And the pedals are very neat to turn in, so I'm not going to actually catch anybody as I walk along the pavement. Or That's right. Along the pavement. It, it's basically as narrow as that, so that you can wheel it down mm. a railway platform. Yes, places like um, that. Would you pick it up, and how much does it weigh? I mean, this version actually weighs 20 pounds. But, um, what do you envisage in, pro in uh, production? I think in production around about £16, mm. bearing in mind all these parts will be uh, made much lighter. These are all machined from solid. Yes, yes. How is the actual joints of the whole bike put together? Is there anything novel in those? Yes, um, basically they would be aluminium die castings mm. and they attach the tubes by a single part epoxy adhesive, mm. um, which means there's no welding. Yeah, so assembly is quite straightforward and similar. Right, really. sort of almost yeah. do it in your kitchen. Mm. Right. 